guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be another project pan intro um this is going to be the disney animated film project pan this project pan was started by the fantastic ladies if you don't know who the fantastic ladies are where have you been <laughs> um i'm doing another project pan with them the fire and ice project pan if you haven't checked that out i have my intro and my first update up on my channel if you want to go check it out Basically, the Fantastic Ladies is just a Facebook group community full of a bunch of supportive ladies who also want to join in projects like this. Um, it's free to join if you have a Facebook. You just go and you answer a few questions just to make sure that it's not you're not like a spam or anything. Um, and they accept you and then you can sign up for whatever project that you would like. Down in the description bar, I'm going to list all of the ladies that are doing this specific project. This project was created by a wonderful lady named Robin Tucker. Sorry, I'm looking down. I have all my notes. So the rules for this project is that you pick 5 to 15, yeah, 5 to 15 products that remind you of Disney animated movies. Could be literally any Disney movie and you just pick products that remind you of the movie. This project is going from June 15th when you're seeing this video and the finale is going to be on November 21st. So that is when The Incredibles 2 release on June 15th to The Wreck-It Ralph 2 release on November 21st. So that was all of the rules. Now let's jump in and I'm gonna show you what products that I have picked. So. I've picked six products, um, I know that's like not even close to 15, but it said 5 to 15, and I just wanted to do six because I have another The Fire and Ice Project Pan going on as well, and then there's another Fantastic Ladies project coming up in a few days. Um, so I just went with six products and made it simple, and I'm going to show you the product and then tell you what movie the product goes with. So let's just get started. So the first product that I picked for this project is my NARS, what are these things called? Velvet Matte Lip Pencil and this one's in Cruella. So I will be surprised if anybody in this project who has this hasn't picked it because duh, Cruella DeVille from the 101 Dalmatians. So this is how much I have left. I have sharpened it a few times, but I don't wear this one all too often. Um, my goal is to finish this by the end of the project. Um, if I don't end up finishing it, I'm probably just gonna toss it at the end of the project because it's super old. So I want to get as much use out of it as I can in this project, and then if I don't wind up finishing it, I'm just gonna toss it. So this was the first product, NARS lip pencil in Cruella for 101 Dalmatians. The second product that I picked is from my Sephora Minnie Mouse palette. Um, I'm not really sure if there's a movie with Minnie in it now that I think about it. Oh well. I picked it because Minnie is from like Mickey and Minnie. Duh. <laughs> I'm sure there's some kind of movie with Minnie in it. Anyway, this is what the palette looks like. It's pretty much untouched. I got it for Christmas from my boyfriend's mother. And I'm going to choose the shade right here called Miss Minnie. And I just want to hit pan on it. Um, now if I wind up hitting pan on it really fast, I might like throw in other shades from this palette. But for right now, I'm just going to be focusing on this shade called Miss Minnie. So the third product that I'm going to put in this project is from another palette. This is the Cinderella palette. This is, I don't know, this is from Sephora. Um, it's like when they did their whole princess collection. They had, um, a couple years ago, they had um, like the Ariel collection, they had the Jasmine collection, they had the Cinderella collection. I don't know, it's not like Sephora brand, but I really don't know what brand it is. But it was in Sephora. This is just 
the Cinderella eyeshadow palette and this is what it looks like on the inside and in this one and the mini palette you can pop this out so like when I finish if I ever finish this palette I can keep the box and use it as like a jewelry box or something just for storage but for this palette obviously for the movie Cinderella I'm going to pick Pumpkin Coach and I'm just going to work on that and my goal is to just hit pan and again if I hit pan on it I'll probably just pick a different shade from this palette to replace it if I hit pan on it super quickly. The fourth product in this project pan is coming from my Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Volume 1 eyeshadow palette and it is this shade this shade right here called Mermaid and if you can't already guess this shade is going to be for the movie The Little Mermaid that is my absolute favorite movie I didn't wind up getting like the Ariel palette like this I didn't even buy this this was a gift also from my boyfriend's mom um, but this is the shade Mermaid and there's a pretty good dip in it it's just a gold shade doesn't really swatch too good at the moment because I have a slight bit of a tan so it's kind of my skin tone but this shade is called mermaid and it's for the movie the little mermaid so my goal for this shadow is to just hit pan on it and this one might be easier than all of the other ones because it does have a slight dip in it so once I hit pan on it, I might throw in another shade from this palette. And I know like this isn't like an aerial palette, but it does have like other shades in it that will remind me of aerial, like seashell, wave, reef, starfish. So this palette is kind of like an under the sea palette. And I know I could have thrown in like this palette that literally looks like a sea uh, seashell, but I just got this and I love this so I'm not I literally could have thrown in anything like I literally have this the seashell palette this highlight palette has a mermaid on it like I feel like I'm crazy with the mermaid stuff but this eyeshadow is literally named mermaid so I went with this one so this shadow is for the little mermaid and my goal is to hit pan on it so the fifth product that I'm putting in this project is a highlighter and it is this Pixie by Petra Beauty Blush Duo in Peach Honey and I know it says blush duo but it's way too light on me to be a blush so I use it as a highlight and this is for the movie Peter Pan because it's green and it says Pixie on it and it reminded me of Tinkerbell. So this is for Peter Pan and let me just swatch it for you. I'm wearing it today. It's this one right here. So my goal for this is to at least hit pan on it, but I'm probably just going to keep using it until the end of the project and get as much use of it as possible. I think I got this in an Ipsy bag, but I'm not sure. I mean, I probably got an Ipsy bag. I don't remember buying this, so yeah. Tinkerbell Beauty Blush Duo in Peach Honey. So the sixth and final product is something that has been in a project pan before, but it's going in this one so I can finally use it up. This is my mini Bite Amuse Bouche lipstick in Honeycomb. This is all I have left. I marked it on this paper. This is all I have left, and this is for one of the Winnie the Pooh movies because he loves honey and honey is stored in honeycomb. So this reminded me of Winnie the Pooh and I really don't have a ton left so I feel like I can totally finish that up. I just need to soak it up and do it. So those are my six products. I know it's a bit ambitious with two lipsticks and three eyeshadows and a red lipstick. I feel like I put a red lipstick in every single project. I have a, a red lipstick in my Fire and Ice project right now, so this is probably not going to get a ton of use until that one is complete, but I do have until November to finish that, so we'll see. Whatever I use up, I use up. 
So those are my six products. I hope you enjoyed this intro. Please give it a thumbs up if you did and please subscribe down below. Hit that little bell to get notifications of every time that I upload a video and please leave comments down below of future videos that you'd like to see. Thanks for watching. Bye!